she has like a on the startup, but on the startup, yeah. and when she lands, but not like as she's going. Yeah, I I get what you mean now. All right. All right. Everything's looking. Uh, no prominent upsets in pools. No, I just see K9 actually didn't come, so it was a DQ. Yeah, that's unfortunate. I would have um, loved to see more of his wolf. But I know he, he, he's always trying to look for Oh, Ryan. yeah. This is going to be top 16. Yep. This Vlad is a winner's quarters match. So, yeah. XX versus Vladin. And I feel like, I think XX has been performing really well in recent SoCal tourneys, right? Wow. And it, I'm checking bracket, and I see that Roots is going to have a rerun with T3 Dome. Oh. He's going to get the run back. Okay. But All right. Hopefully, T3 can bring that out for UCI. But on to this match, though. XX versus Vladin. All right. All right, already Xax keeping Vladin at the ledge. Great back air, near fair. Good pressure. And the bomb? And he's dead. That that was. Wow. That I have was... never seen Inkling do that in my life, but I want to see more of it now. Yeah, that was some innovative bomb play. That is Xax. I'm not sure how long he's been playing Inkling, but just from the get-go, I can tell he is very proficient with this character. Oh, he yeah. knows the ins and outs, and he knows not only the bread and butters, but how to be innovative with the character's moves. And I think that separates like a good player of a character from a great player of a character. Yeah, it looks like he can think. He, he just thought of that probably on the spot. It wasn't something confirmed. It's not a confirmed Inkling combo. So good showing so far from Exax. All right, Vladin bringing it back, though, has XX at the ledge. Yeah, he's not too far behind. Just needs to confirm the kill and uh, attack on 10%. He's even. XX brings himself back onto the stage, though. Vladin tries to swat him out with Ooh. the forward tilt this yeah, time. Yeah, he did that the sliding kill. forward tilt. Yeah, that's new ultimate mechanics, being able to forward tilt out of a dash, right? Exactly. Yeah. So even though XX brought it out of the gates, that first stock, now we're looking to see a much more even match. Oh, just dropping down from that platform, slamming him with the forward air. Oh, does Dancing oh. Blade on the shield not No save. punish on the whiff Dancing Blade. Yeah, that was interesting. I'm pretty sure that's very punishable. What I'm noticing is that wow. XX, oh, is he going to get anything? No, too low for percent for like an up smash confirm. Yeah, so he just went for the, for the percent, went for the back air. One thing I'm noticing about XX is that his aerial drifts with Inkling are very, just very, I don't know the word for it, but the way he just swings back and forth ever so slightly, like, especially from like an empty hop, it's great micro spacing, I should say. You're saying he like worms through the hitboxes? Yeah, he sort of like worms his way back and All forth, right. and that kind of throws Vladin off, I feel. Yeah, very good evasive play. Up throw up air, that's not. I don't. I still don't know whether that's actually true or not. I remember at the beginning of the, the game, up air? people said it was true. I think it's still true. It's just. Uh, I know it's a tight window for sure. Yeah. All, All right. right. So, Aladdin's actually brought this really. He's brought it back. Yeah, absolutely. Next strong hit will bring the momentum in that player's favor. Oh, oh he wanted to roll it ground. Slightly missed. Fourth throw for that extra ink. Oh, he wanted back throw there, but grab range of Inkling, not so good. Vladin actually having a 0.8% lead now. Oh, and that Nair will do it. Yeah. So Vladin, even though he got sort of bodied that first stock, he was almost there to it death. back. Yeah. It's like, he, uh, again, he's, he's just downloading how to play against a certain player. Yeah, definitely. Oh, Exas getting a bit greedy there with that second roller hit. See it. He's looking for the back air kill. Yeah, just these delayed aerial attacks on Vladin's shield, trying to get him to sort of release shield and seal yeah. this, this stock. I think Inkling Fair will definitely definitely kill. I'm not sure about the back air at this percent from center not stage. Not that. Well, oh. grounded. There you go. Down smash. Easy stock there. Yeah, especially 180. You're gonna die. We've had a lot of last stock situations on stream. I'd say like I haven't seen many blowouts. Yeah. Everyone seems to be able to just adapt on the fly and just do well versus their opponents. That's a good thing. All right, Vladin with a 50-ish percent lead. All right, starting to X -X see some. lands a grab, though. Gets Inkling a bit of damage. Comes. The delay on the down smash. Oh, oh, he misses the back air. Yeah. That's 
That's very bad for Exax. That might... Wait. Oh. oh. Caught him sleeping Wait. at the ledge. Good pressure. This is anyone's match the ladder now. fighting back. Trying to take that center stage. There he goes. Playing very safe. Not there. Catch, you know. Okay, Valadin goes in for the grab. It misses. What's Xaxx's option from the ledge? He jumps in. He tries to land that back here, but Valadin just sees all these late fares and bears coming every time he is ready to shield it. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure Valadin could be edge guarding this Inkling Uppy. Yeah, he hasn't not. gone out to edge guard that. Yeah, at this percent, an Inkling won't be able to attack it. Won't be able to attack a wall tag. Maybe this time? Oh! Perfect. Right as you said it, yep. Rafi. He goes out there. Great timing yeah. with that down air spike. Clutching out. Game one. Commentator blessing. Hang on, Valadin. Gotcha, my man. Well, that's uh, if Valadin actually takes this, it's gonna be, a, I think it's gonna be a huge upset. That's actually. a huge upset. That's like yeah. third seed versus, uh, like someone who's not even I top think, eight I seed. I think XX is top three in NorCal. Oh, top three in NorCal? Yeah. Yeah. Because I know that there's um, Prodigy. I think it's number one yeah, there. Yeah, Prodigy. Luis. Uh, I think yeah, Luis, Luis. Kalatu, I mean, yeah, XX. Very good yeah. player in his own right. All right, so we'll see color how he counter pick for XX. Going for the blue inkling this Very time Very important. Around. Very important. Color yeah. counter pick is one of the biggest things in the game. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We're seeing it work out once again. Starting out the first stock very strong. Okay. All right. All right. Great back here from XX. Yeah, once again, like, we see this aerial drift from XX trying to sort of bait an attack out from Valadin. Yeah, and he calls out the spot dodge from Valadin there and puts him off stage with the grab. Oh, try I feel like he expected Valadin to jump in and that's why he up smashed, but instead, Valadin playing it safe. Yeah. Whoa! Whoa! Was that a two frame? That, I th that, that was, was a two frame. That was definitely a two that frame. That was so smart. The perfect timing yeah, from Valadin. I, I have to give him some props there because yeah. Inkling is actually one of the hardest characters to, to two frame. Yeah. And there we have it, up throw, up air, bringing yeah. it back in to two stock to two stock situation. You know what that's called, the up air, up throw, up air? Is that a Womi? Uh, <laughs> Booyah? I oh, think yeah, that's the term. The, <laughs> yeah, probably the Booyah. Right. Anyway, exact. Or actually, no, Valadin starting has a very strong lead here. Oh, shield breaker. You have to watch out for that. Whoa, this is in winner's quarters. If Valadin wins this, he makes winner's semis. At a yeah, winner's semis top eight. That would be amazing for Valadin. Yeah. And, you know, he might just do it. If he can seal this second stock, then he has a fighting there chance. Go. There we go. I Last think... stock for Exax on winner's side. I wonder if Valadin has a lot of practice. I know that Mage is also from North Hollywood, and I think they do play a lot. So maybe that's where he got the... Oh. And he reads right back with the forward smash. Yeah, Another it, last stock situation here. Yeah. Only 25% lead for Valadin. Let's see if he can just continue with his momentum and take the 2-0. All right. He, he only gets 19% off of that conversion. I feel like he could have done better with more. There we wow. go. That's the classic. Great like inkling 30%. Combos. And he wanted, the, he wanted a forward smash off of that like, bomb hitting. Yeah, he just wanted to end it there. Not going to get it, though. Yeah, See if Valadin bit. can bring it, back, bring back his lead because he was leading the whole game. Yeah, sort of like a reversal of the last game, I'd say. Yeah. Like, Exax had the early lead, and then Valadin bring it back, brought it back. Now we might see Exax bring it back. Oh, nice down tilt, down tilt. though. Covering the roller, saving his stock actually. He has another oh, lead. Oh, that forward air was so unsafe. Yeah, he overextended. I'm not gonna get the two frame there. And he calls out the roller with. Can he edge guard it? Oh no. He no, he doesn't go, go out there. He wants to play it safe. And uh, at this point, I can respect that. There you go. Punishing down smash with another forward air. Calling the jump with the forward air. Yeah, he's just catching all of X Axe's ledge One options. Good strong hit will actually finish the set. Up throw up air? No, he air dodges out of it. Retreats yeah. to ledge. Smart option from Vladin. Kind of that Calling. back here will connect! That back here will kill. And Valadin takes it 2-0. He's moving on yeah. to winner semis in a pretty big upset. And I, I I don't know if you saw that there, but 